Hello, hope all are doing fine. I've completed my project. I've made a full-fledged 3D model of it. Now I want to take this project to the client's place to conduct a presentation. I can stick to different methods for that. I can either take the file in a pen drive, go to the client's place to make the presentation, or I can take the file in my laptop and go to the client to give a presentation, or else I can even mail it. Even if we have all these methods, it will be always better if you can take it in a portable computing device such as your smartphone or on your tablet. And that is exactly what you do using AutoCAD mobile app. Using this app, you can not only conduct presentations, you can also create, edit, annotate and share AutoCAD drawing files in a more convenient manner. Before we move on to the video, I request all of you to subscribe to my YouTube channel SabirCAD if you haven't subscribed already and hit the bell icon to get instant alerts on my future video uploads. So let's get started. If you want to take AutoCAD software with you, you need an Autodesk ID in the first place. For that, you have to visit accounts.autodesk.com website then click on create account button. Here you can give the required information and check this box and click on create account button. Now you can click on the sign in button at the status bar and give the user ID and password. I have logged in in my account. Now I have finished my 3D model. I want to conduct a presentation to my client. At this point, you can save your file to the local hard disk first. I'll just click on the application button, click on save as and I'll keep it on the desktop and I'll call it as new 3D house and click on save. Next you can save this file to your cloud. For that in older releases of AutoCAD you have to click on file save as drawing to the cloud option to save to your cloud service which is the Autodesk 360 cloud storage given to you by the company. But I am using AutoCAD 2019 which is the latest release of AutoCAD in 2019. In this release you have an icon on top that is save to web and mobile. Just click on that icon. Now it will ask you for the file name. The file name is the same. Now click on save. Now it is saved to the cloud. Now let's open this file in a smartphone as well as in a tablet. In order to demonstrate this concept, I am going to make use of two devices. One is an Android device which is Samsung Galaxy S9 Plus and the second device is Apple iPad Pro which works on iOS or Apple operating system. To start with, you have to install AutoCAD app in both devices. I have already installed AutoCAD DWG Viewer and Editor app in my S9 Plus as well as an iPad Pro. Now I am going to open the AutoCAD app by tapping on the icon. Now you can see all the files which are saved in the cloud. From this I am going to open the new 3D house project file. You can see a panel fly out at the upper right corner in blue color. Just tap on that. When you tap on the gear icon at the upper right corner, you will get object snap and other settings which is required when you perform drafting using the web version of AutoCAD. When you tap on the eye icon right next to the layer icon, you will see various visualization options such as 2D, 3D wireframe and 3D solid. The current representation is 2D. Now I'll tap on 3D wireframe. This is how the object will appear in 3D wireframe. Next I'll tap on the 3D solid and you can see the shaded representation which is more realistic. Now you can conduct a presentation by performing view based navigations such as zoom, pan, orbit etc. You can perform pin zooming using two fingers. You can perform panning by moving two fingers along the screen. And you can orbit the view using a single finger. You can also try out a combination of all these gestures and you will feel a lot of flexibility when you compare it with performing the same operations using the mouse. Now I'll again tap on the panel flyout at the upper right corner and on the layer icon and you will see the list of all the layers you have used in this drawing. Now I'm going to turn off the 3D roof glare by tapping on the bulb icon corresponding to that layer. 
Now you can see that the display of the roof object is suppressed. Now I'll tap once more on the bulb icon to turn that layer on. You can also perform various layer based operations such as locking, renaming, isolating, inverting and deleting layers. So that was just an overview of how we can open a drawing file and conduct a presentation using AutoCAD mobile app. In the case of an Android device, you will get the same interface and you can stick to the same procedures. In the coming videos, I'll show you how to create, edit, annotate and share drawings using AutoCAD mobile app. We can also connect Leica Disto automatic measuring instrument with this app via Bluetooth and as we take measurements, the values will be automatically plotted in the software. Thank you so much for your patience and time and please hit the like button of this video if you liked it and one more reminder to subscribe to my channel. Until I see you in the next video, bye bye and take care. May God bless you all.